Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you all are doing great. So a simple question for today is what do you think is the main headache of owning an electric vehicle? So the first main reason for not going for an EV is very high initial price. Let's take a simple example in Indian market. So majority of you know Tata Motors offers the vehicle Tata Nexon which comes in both internal combustion engine as well as electric engine. But the catch is their prices. Do you know what are the prices of both? Well, the internal combustion engine Tata Nexon comes at 9 lakhs X showroom, while the electric one comes at 14.5 lakhs. Hence, the price difference is too much, and in all the cases, you will see the electric vehicles are always expensive compared to their internal combustion engine counterparts. Well, I just put this information for your knowledge, and the startup offer today's focus has nothing to do with this price difference. Instead, government of India is helping people with huge subsidies on EV prices. Just take a look at this chart. This chart shows the amount of subsidy the government is offering based on the size of the battery the vehicle holds. But another equally important reason to ignore electric vehicles is lack of charging infrastructure. The charging infrastructure doesn't only mean the charging stations, but it also includes battery swapping stations. If you see this report, it suggests that considering the rate of growth of EVs in India, India needs 1.32 million EV charging stations by 2030. This figure is calculated by considering one charging station per 40 electric vehicles. Till the end of July 2023, the Ministry of Road Transport and Highway found that India in total has just 9,000 public EV charging stations, while there are 28 million electric vehicles operational. If you see the region-wise distribution, Maharashtra has the highest number of electric vehicle charging stations, followed by Delhi and Karnataka. And the startup which we are going to talk about today is helping the nation with this mission. This startup believes in battery swapping instead of battery charging. Also, another main reason why people are yet not prepared to go for EV is their high charging time. Let's take some average figures. Like on average, an EV takes 6 to 8 hours to fully charge on normal charger and in between 1 to 2 hours to reach from 0 to 80 on fast chargers. And even an hour of time is too much considering the quick refills of petrol and diesel vehicles. And this is really, really unreliable during emergency. So with battery swapping, all you are doing is taking the discharge battery out from your vehicle and just putting the charge battery available at the station. Battery Smart is launched in June 2020 by two IIT Kanpur graduates, Pulkit Khurana and Siddharth Sikka. Right now, they have India's largest battery swapping infrastructure. There are several advantages associated with this startup. To name a few, they provide smart and interoperable lithium-ion batteries, wide network of battery swapping stations, just two minutes quick battery swapping, compatibility with both electric three-wheelers as well as two-wheelers and mobile app-based platform. Right now, they are only limited to electric two-wheelers and three-wheelers. For electric four-wheelers, since the market lacks battery standardization and regulation, it is difficult for anyone to offer battery swapping. As we all know, electric three-wheelers are mostly dominated by e-rickshaws, where the type of batteries to be used is well standardized, and somewhat similar the case for electric two-wheelers. This startup is working in close coordination with battery manufacturers, drivers community, and other startups to build a robust ecosystem. This battery swapping technology is primarily important for commercial vehicles like cabs and e-rickshaws since it significantly reduces downtime and increases vehicle utilization. Also as a side effect, this technique has the potential to impose battery standardization in EV battery industry. But battery swapping has several disadvantages too, which our startup is directly dealing with. First thing is, swapping station has high setup and operational costs. The second concern is technical challenges and safety, since battery swapping demands high precision engineering. So let's talk about their sources of funding. In total, they have raised $73.6 million from a total of 17 investors. Latest was their Series B funding round, where they have raised $33 million, which they are going to use for expansion plans. They are very proudly mentioning their achievements. Till today, they have made 17 million plus battery swaps across 774 swapping stations. Right now, they are only present in North Indian cities. So let's hope for their quick expansion. Talking about other startups, Sun Mobility, Battery Pool, Charge Up are some of the startups helping India in this mission. So this was the startup of today's focus, Battery Smart, providing innovative solutions to swap batteries, which enables quick swaps, low downtime and high utilization of fleet vehicles. Thanks for watching. If you are interested in knowing more about this startup, you can visit their website. Check out my other videos to know more about different innovative startups. If you like watching this kind of content, you can consider subscribing to my channel. Hit like this current video. Till then, work hard, enjoy hard.